tukiona bokeje Madam Speaker, I thank you. And the petition on the credit uh, people, who actually in the real sense are Shylocks, is actually very timely. And Madam Speaker, as the petitions committee is looking at this, I am hoping that they will be coming up with proposals that might lead to a legislation. Madam Speaker, predatory lending is so rampant in this country that if you looked around, you will see that there are people who are preying on the, on the needs of Kenyans, on the desperation of Kenyans. People who lend money to people, knowing that these people who are borrowing are extremely desperate. What they then do is that they put a very high interest to make sure that the person borrowing is not able to pay. After that, they come back and claim a property or auction out the, 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 the borrower. Madam Speaker, we need a law that would be able to rein in on these predatory lenders. And I think that might have informed some of the moves that are being made by the government. For example, the Hustler Fund, Madam Speaker, that seeks to plug in into that space where predatory lending had even gone digital, Madam Speaker, that even reputable institutions were lending Kenyans in a predatory manner, Madam Speaker. But Madam Speaker, even as we look at those informal ones, let us also go into the banks, see what banks are doing to Kenyans. If you look at the newspaper, Madam Speaker, you will find 11 pages, acres and acres of properties being uh, taken by auctioneers of Kenyans who are not able to do that. Madam Speaker, finally, allow me this one minute to say to the petitions committee that as they are looking on this petition, they should also consider the matters of uh, the infringement of laws that already exist. The laws like the Kenya Privacy Data Protection Bill, Madam Speaker, these creditors, uh, these uh, predatory lenders are offending the privacy of data owners in Kenya. The law on, um, on the computer misuse and cybercrime, the way they infringe on people's privacy when they are claiming the money that they had lent to Kenyans, even that is an infringement on laws that exist. So even as we are looking on new laws, Madam Speaker, let us call them out for the laws that they are offending, laws that already exist. I appreciate this opportunity, Madam Speaker. Thank you. Member for Malava.